see how this goes. I looked at my cell and I thought about calling you. And I looked at my cell and I'm like, dude, I wonder who gets calls in heaven. I know you can't pick up the phone in heaven. Yeah, you know, at the moment things don't add up. And I wish we could back up to the days that we believe that will be the next in the line. That will be the next ones that we find on top. You know, because the world was ours and you know we thought the world was a pedestal. But you know, things change with the luck of a without without you, dude, I feel lost. I'm telling you. I write in this and I teared up because you know, I feel lost. I can't believe life is like this. Yo, you're my conscience. Yo, you're always there to tell me when to slow down. Yo, son, you're being obnoxious. I was always being obnoxious, it's hard to admit. I remember once the time, you know, you and me almost got into a fist fight, staring eye to eye. It looked like we were about to fight and I was back down and Nally had to come break us up. Yo, thank you for introducing Nally, because believe it or not, dog, she's in my heart. You know, and I am first to admit that I'm not very smart, but I love that girl with all my heart. You and me were a team, unstoppable, nothing could, nothing could break us. First really crew I ran with was you, you know, that's it, that's it. You met me when I was 17, you know, I was a little bit green, you took me under your wing. Life was ever better. Yo, you're my big brother and you're always there when I needed you. I called, you were right there. Oh, I, you called me and I was right there. Now you think twice. Every time I look at December 25th, I'll call you every year to say happy birthday. And now I'm like, who am I calling to say happy birthday? I mean, it's been, we know each other almost 10, 11 years. And, yo, and straight out with me and you together with no fears. Um, you know, honestly, life was, hasn't been the same since that day. And I'm telling you right now, yo, I remember when your girl called me and leave me that message and I was like, I had to sit down because I almost fell down. I was lost. I was, that phone call almost made me lose my balls. I... I'm sorry, I'm just rambling on a little bit. But I almost fell down and I just thinking about you. Next stop, what's next? I mean, you up there, I know you're looking out for me and I appreciate it, but no, I can't help it, I miss you. Sorry, rambled on, guys. I didn't even look at it. Wait, right.